everyone, welcome back to Amanda T and me, and welcome back to Gosha. Okay, so we've opened new parts of the house, um, and this time I'm going to be a little more careful and like really drag some of the objects around um, because uh, clearly I've I've made some missteps along the way. So grab yourself something cozy and let's get into it. All right. So, back to the house. Um, now let's go ahead and... It looks like we've got some more stuff over here. So let's go to the back of the house. Yeah, um, what I was talking about last time is out here in the cemetery, there was this. And it was like, you could see in the ground that there was an opening and I just didn't get that. Guys, I love puzzle games. I'm just so bad at them. So I hope you appreciate my uh, candidness on that topic. Okay, so let's go this way because it's not orange that we've resolved. Okay, this looks all new. Let's go this way. Okay, so this is a stairwell. We've been to the stairwell. Okay, see there's a... I don't know what this thing is. And that's... So I think we open green? No, no, this is all we know. Okay. I don't know what that means. Um, let's go down. Oh yeah. Okay. We have a children's child's bedroom. Let's go as far. Oh, okay. That's a lot. All right. So I guess we'll start in the greenhouse and see where that all goes. Uh, let's go down and just see where that leads us. I don't know any of this. So this is all new stuff. Okay, let's start in the greenhouse. I think I think that's a big enough space for us to really get ourselves into anyway. Like this is obviously a thing. Alex, thank you so much for fixing my train. It's still missing a wheel, but it's balanced better now and it can run again. Is it true what mother said? that I could live forever driving my locomotive and that I'll be as happy as the day father gave it to me? If it's true, you would be wrong to oppose her because I would really like that. But I trust you. I will meet you tonight as planned. Ooh. Um, here's a, is an organ? Oh, a barrel organ. It must have sounded fantastic in the greenhouse. It seems incomplete though. I see no mechanism to activate it. Okay. Um, what could you put atop this small piece of furniture? A candlestick maybe? Um, Or is it control? Oh, it's control. Gosh, I always get C and control really screwed up in this game. Okay. Alright, so that part's resolved. This place is huge. Alright, there's a balcony here. And then all the way down. Okay. All right. Um. Let's check out where this balcony goes. All right. So this leads into a child's bedroom, and then up. Um. Got dollies. 
Did his arm slide or move? It must. I must be imagining things. This room must be Edward's. Still, he'd be a bit too old sketch for sketches like these. Mm. Oh. This chest is full of toys and stuffed animals. It's very heavy, too. Oh. We're supposed to move it at some point. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Some adventure stories, an encyclopedia, and a few magazines. Um, okay. So this was some... This wheel could be useful. Yeah, I think it's for his train. This toy is only a shadow of its former part. It's falling apart. Okay. Okay, I need to be able to see where to... Alright, I think that's everything in here. Let's go this way. Alright, um... Okay, um, I guess we'll just leave it here for now. And here's the dark room. And all the stuff inside. So this is below the child's room. What a mess. This lounge was much more welcoming in my memories. What a mess. This lounge was much... Okay. And then who... We can't learn who this is? This old mirror is stained. And of course I can't see my own reflection. Um... This is something. Some documents and newspapers. Most of them are from 1910. Oh, what's this? The plants in the greenhouse are completely out of control. There's no comfort to be found in here. Is this all the same? It looks like there's something else. Hmm. I don't know. So there was something with like a patrol, right? Let's go down. I thought there was a room with a yeah. Okay, look at this. We can't touch that. A gramophone. I can see a record. It. Looks like it works. Hmm. This briefcase is full of punch cards. They make me think of the cylinder of, um, of a music box. Where do we see a music box? Um. Okay, let's put that on the floor for now. Such a big clock on the ground. That's impressive. Where do we see a music box? <gasps> Maybe the, um... No one's lit a fire here for ages. The spider web seemed to confirm this. Okay. Um, can we use... Remember this. Okay. Um, 
There's literally nothing in this room of value? You can't tell me that. Um, white powder, okay. Okay, now let's go to our notes. Um, actually, let's go to our journal. Okay, so we have a new mystery. Um, I love the Manor's East Wing and the Winter Garden so much, but now the old plants are out of control. I don't really know what I'm looking for, and I'm afraid of getting closer every to every item I find. Elrius mentioned horrible experiments to bind souls to objects, and I dread the thought of coming across the results of this madness. I might not have a choice. I'm terrified to think that Annie or one of her sons might be trapped in this way. A magnificent barrel organ wasn't in the greenhouse when I was still living here. I would love to play it, but I don't see any music for it, unless the punch cards are behind the steel sheet under the... Okay, we have punch cards then. Um... All right, so this is resolved. Okay, we did resolve one of these things. Okay, let's go back up and see if we can apply the punch cards here. Mm, it would be it's the Vitrola over here. I keep calling it Vitrola. It's definitely, I think that's like an actual name brand. Um, okay, so this way, and then up the steps, gotta appreciate some of the logic of moving objects around this house, and then this way. Oh, oh, uh oh. Wait, where else do we see sheet music? On the piano. Um, okay. Where did we see a piano? First floor, right? Let's go to the beginning. I thought... At some point we've seen a piano and I wonder if we're supposed to use the sheet music for that. Wait, do we have um, sheet music in our journal? The sheet music is not in our journal. What is this? Okay, that's that's an oldie. Okay. All right, so that's not it. been really paranoid lately um, with like people stealing packages and and all sorts of stuff so I'm like constantly checking our camera no Where did we see sheet music? Because I like, my reaction was absolute terror because um, I'm only mediocre at best at reading music. And that's assuming that it's in C major. <laughs> Just 
tapestry is super interesting. Hmm. I definitely pick some up though. I also want to know what that locket is about. Um, if we So this is Ferris. Something called the Silver Labyrinth. up. No, we can go in. Alright. I do think it's very strange that there's nothing in this room. So I feel like you'd be able to pick up cards. Where do we see the sheet music? Was it in the basement? And that's it for this. Do we see sheet music in the church? So there's also this that we didn't resolve last time. Eighty-seven. Yeah. And this is the edge of the painting. And that's how we pass through to the bunker? Yeah. really strange. Let's go to the church. I don't think there's something here, but I'd like to be certain of it.
I just want to be sure. I I was positive. What is this? So it's left to the handle. It's weird that I. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? <gasps> is this some sort of underground shelter? Who would settle down in this cesspit? Oh my goodness. So, ew, another cockroach. The shopkeeper used to keep a logbook. Maybe I'll find some clues in there. 14 November, a strange silence surrounded the manor. I was fetching wood around the forest when suddenly all the animals went quiet. At dusk, most uncanny, that's for sure. 16 November, rumors for, of bombing in Coventry. Curse them. I hope they don't turn their attention to an isolated place like Oak Marsh. 21 November, the old woman came by the Stanfords and left a few minutes later. She looks like she was in a hurry. I feel ill at ease when she's around. You never know what she thinks, even if she's looking straight in the eye. Looking at you straight in the eye. The less I see of her, the better. 2 December, a young Blackwood came today. Alexander, I think. He wanted to rent the flat behind our shop. An old storage room and a stable aren't much, especially for a well-bred child, but it's more money in my pocket, so I said yes. He seems normal enough, but I'll keep my eyes peeled. 15 December, lights over Blackwood, and there were no Christmas decorations or bombs. 16 December, I swear I heard screams coming from there. They echoed across the whole valley. I'm still shaking at the thought. 25 December, Merry Christmas. 25 January. Going near the manor always made me anxious, but now it's all the more terrifying. I can almost hear whispers coming from the walls, something haunting, like a word repeated over and over until it sounds strange in one's mind. I can still hear it. It was something like, Emma Figor, Emma Figor, Emma Figor. It never stops. I felt the air shiver and the roof shifted. I ran back to the village, shouting at the top of my lungs. That settles it. I'm closing my shop and I will never leave here again. 28 January. Emma and George are leaving. They'll be leaving their daughter here, though I don't really understand why. I suppose she wants to stay with Alexander. I think they're right. There is nothing else that can be done. I should leave too, to visit my boys in London. If they haven't forgotten, they have a father. Oh, wild. Okay. Lots of books. Hmm. So that's all that's here. And I think that's a good place to leave it. Um, let's check out the flat behind the shop again. Also, we're still looking for music. So. Alright, let's go ahead and go back to the menu. I think that autumn... We are at 51%, my goodness. Okay. Alrighty guys, well that's all for this time. Thank you so much for coming to hang out. I can't believe I didn't see the illumination, but again, that was before I um, really started carrying objects around. So hey, it worked out this time. So alrighty guys, until next time, take care and happy sipping.